I'm Steve High. I am the manager of technology at the CARA program. Uh, the CARA program is a workforce development organization. We focus on homeless, nearly homeless, and get them back into the workforce. Our primary focus is about changing the person. It's all about transforming their, uh, the way they approach uh, work and getting them back into the workforce. Uh, my role there is uh, uh, focused on tech strategy. It's a mix of actual hands-on infrastructure kind of stuff, but it's focused primarily on uh, improving their business process, their project management, the way they implement their tech, and then actually having it uh, be driven by a purposeful strategy uh, rather than just you know, meeting daily needs and uh, um, departmental needs. So the session title is uh, Technology Plan Smackdown. Uh, it's tr tactical versus strategic versus missional tech planning. And it's kind of a play on words a little bit because it's not really, it's not, the session is not really going to be about how to choose which one because really ideally in the long term you're doing all three. But it's to demonstrate that there is a very clear distinction between the three types of planning. So tactical is uh, focused primarily on it's the infrastructure, it's keeping the lights on, it's making sure that the staff computers are working, the network is there, the telecommunications, you've got a tech replacement plan, uh, but a key to really the, the infrastructure part of it, or the tactical, is having a purposeful method of focusing on problem solving and less on incident uh, reporting. So help desk reporting and metrics and uh, looking at the stability of things is key to tactical. So in the tactical plan really is as simple as doing an inventory, looking at what your future needs are, and then doing a gap analysis. So it's like, what do we have? What's working? What's not working? And then what needs to be replaced? And then lay it out over the next year, three years, five years. Uh, so it's pretty straightforward on how to do tactical tech planning. That's what we're most all familiar with. The next level is strategic. And strategic is, uh, everybody kind of understands strategic technology planning. It's you take the strategic plan, you take the departmental needs, you take staff needs, you kind of do some prioritization, uh, you know, whatever the big priorities are for the organization, you pick the right technology to support those priorities. And it's, so it's pretty straightforward. Um, the difference with missional planning it, it is at the end, it, that's, it, we've kind of made up this word of missional tech planning, it, but it is a real thing. And it, the difference between that one and the other two is it requires you to go above and beyond what your org does and look at the impact you're trying to have on the people you serve and what your mission actually is. So what you do is you start from the mission statement, start from uh, the big impact you're having and look for areas where your org just doesn't have the capacity to do something within the constraints that it has where technology can take you further. So what, what, are those, what are those defining things that are like, okay, we can only do this, we can only do this much work, but where is there a technology that breaks that barrier and can do work that maybe we just don't have time to do? And so the life cycle of those is everybody should be doing tactical tech planning. And that is the place to start. You need to have a good re a replacement plan. You need to have a normal every year review of where you are, an assessment, a gap analysis, some good budgeting around that so that you have the, always have the right tech. Strategic every like three to five years. And I, I would say that, again, almost every org should have a strategic plan, but at varying levels. It should be, you know, there's one strategic plan that's just tied straight to, to your org's strategic plan. I would go above and beyond that and look for a way to do a, a cross-functional team in the organization where everybody gets together, discusses the needs, comes up with priorities, voting. If you're not there yet, start just with breaking down your strategic plan. And then missional, I think it, it, with the high end of strategic and with missional, don't do it until your organization is really ready and has the capacity to act on those things because it's, it, it, it would be uh, a major stepping kind of fault. If you start to, oh, we got this great big idea, but your computers aren't working and your network is breaking and you're, you're not, you, your staff are still waiting three minutes for the things to work right. And you know, there, you've got departments asking for big things in your strategic plan and you're not able to do those. So don't start missional until you actually really have the capacity. And then when you do start a missional kind of tech plan, allow years for, for it to actually happen and work and then look for outside resources to help you to it. Look for uh, other partners, collaborating organizations, find some board members that are passionate about your mission and understand tech a little. Um, and really do a needs analysis of, of, of the capacity of your org compared to the impact and mission that you want to do.